the life of E and K. I'm filming a video about guinea pigs, and it's really nice outside too. So here's all the different toys I have, and I'm going to be telling you the best toys and the worst toys. So let's get started. Here I have a kebab toy, which has a little bell on the bottom. I would say this toy is okay. It is this Bendy Wood Log, which I'm sure other channels talk about this. I really do love this. You can just take a look at the shoe. They haven't chewed it that much because they have a lot of other toys, but but they love it. So And they also like to sit under here, so I really recommend this toy. I think that it's awesome. Next up is these Timothy Hay Twist. So two different brands make these, the Petco brand and then Oxbow brand. These are the Petco brand ones. And here's one that I put on here. And if I don't put it on here, then they eat it instantly. So here I have a loofah toy, which I have not gave to the guinea pigs yet. But overall, my guinea pigs do like loofah. I know some people's guinea pigs hate loofah. And in, if you, in case you don't know what loofah is, it's the breading and the lettuce on here. It's kind of like this wiry stuff, which my guinea pigs do enjoy. So the different types of sticks I have here. Small willow stick. And in case you guys don't know what the difference, willow sticks have really small, limited bark. And my guinea pigs uh, aren't crazy over these, but they do chew them. I have applewood sticks, which are a thicker uh, barked wood. And as you can see, guinea pigs really do like them. And yeah, I bought these from a variety pack at the pet store. And then here is one that I got on a National Geographic kebab thing. And it looks like it's been chewed, but it just like kind of splinters off because there's no real bark. So if you're looking for stuff like this, guinea pigs tend to like the ones that have bark on them. Next is this yarn twisted toy. My guinea pigs did not even chew this. That's just my guinea pigs, so maybe your guinea pigs will like it. Interior cage thing. We got this the, over December. And I used it a while for the vegetables. Then I realized that the guinea pigs like it more when it's just on the ground. But you could use it for a hay ball, but it doesn't hold a lot of hay, so you have to like refill it. It doesn't really hold like small pieces, so uh, I didn't like this one. I think this was kind of a waste of money. Cat toys, which I don't ever unsupervise them because they are made out of plastic. So if they're not supervised, they could eat this. But I put it in their floor time, you know, thing. So yeah, this one was eh for only 50 cents because I got two for a dollar. Uh, yeah, this is good, but they don't really, um, my guinea pigs don't really love them, but just try them out, because maybe they will. This wooden bead from the National Geographic kit, and yeah, my guinea pigs didn't like it at all. Because, I mean, so, if it makes sense, it's like sphere-shaped, so for them to chew on the sphere, it's like physically impossible, because it's like... And Next are these really common for hamsters, but guinea pigs can also chew them too, these little colored pencil things. So here's just one of them. My guinea pigs do like these a lot. I think it's because they're wood, but they like to chew the pencil lead. Lead. It's not really lead. It's just painted wood. But I prefer to get from the natural stuff more just because I know that they're not eating all this coloring. Here I have this wooden toy, which you know my guinea pigs like wood, but for some reason they didn't like this one. I forgot to film an outro to this video, but just so you know, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and I spent forever editing this video, so please show your support by leaving a like. See y'all later. Bye!